Hi everyone, my name is Alex. Today I'm going to be trying the La Roche Posay 10% Pure Niacinamide Serum. This product retails for $40. I have never tried a La Roche Posay product on this channel before. I have used some of their products whenever my skin was going through it. I know this is a staple brand for so many people. I hear so many people talk about all of their products and how they've done amazing things for their skin. And so I'm excited to be trying out this new serum from them. I'm not really sure what to expect, but this product has a lot of great claims behind it. And so I'm excited to see what this product does. The highlighted ingredients in this product include niacinamide and hyaluronic acid. To check out the full ingredient list, make sure you click the link in the description to go to their website. I did look at the ingredient list and it does have alcohol in it. Now alcohol, there is a lot of misconception about alcohol in skincare. I feel like it used to be viewed as a really drying, really bad product for your skin. That's not necessarily true. Sometimes it could be used in skincare and not cause any dryness, so that would just be something I'm looking for. What do I see with this product? Product and what does it do for my skin? Obviously this product is very expensive and I know of other very affordable niacinamide serums at this concentration and so I will also be looking for if it is worth it in my opinion and how it stands out from the rest of the niacinamide serums that I am familiar with. Obviously they're from brands like the Inky List and the Ordinary and so whenever you're releasing a niacinamide serum I feel like it is important to take into consideration what those products are doing for your skin compared to the very affordable options that those brands have. As for anything else, I will be continuing to do check-ins. So I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, I'm here to give you all a quick check-in on this product. I have been using this product for about a week and I am experiencing just a couple of minor breakouts. I'm sick again. Whenever I get sick, I always get a couple of zits coming up on my skin. So I don't think it's related to this product. I have been using it both day and night and something that I love about it is that it kind of destigmatizes the ingredient alcohol in skincare. I have always known it to be a really bad thing that alcohol is in skincare, but since I've educated myself on alcohol and the purpose in skincare, it's not always a bad thing. This product has not been drying, and once I show you the texture of it, you'll see for yourself. It is a pretty hydrating serum, and I am loving it so far. It's been working great for my skin. My skin has been looking very clear, as you can see, like, some of my hyperpigmentation is a little bit more faded and it looks a little bit more radiant. I feel like that is thanks to this product. I haven't really added anything else in my skincare routine. Like I said, just a couple of zits came up, but it just happened today. If I do see repetitive breakouts though, it could either be purging. Sometimes niacinamide causes that, or it could just be my skin going through it, or it could be this product overall, and then I'll have to stop using it. So this comes in a typical dropper and comparing it to some other niacinamide serums that I've seen, this is definitely a very hydrating niacinamide serum. The texture kind of reminds me of the Naturium niacinamide serum. It feels amazing on the skin and it gives a radiant look instantly. It gives a very glowy look to the skin. I'm just going to show you the texture. As you can see there, it is a pretty watery serum, but it gives such a beautiful glow to the skin. The best way I can describe the texture once you rub it in is very silky. It is just such a nice serum. Now it does have a very potent sea salt smell. I think they said they use sea salt water. I'm not for sure in that. And it does linger for just a little while, so just be mindful of that. It doesn't have fragrance in it, but still. All I do is just take a couple of drops of this product. Look at that glow that it delivered to the skin. This is a great product in between your cleanser and your moisturizer. It's a great serum. It doesn't cause any dryness, doesn't cause any sensitivity. Also, after I shave, it doesn't cause any sensitivity, which niacinamide usually does. And so I'm really enjoying this product so far. I feel like it's very well designed. The Roche Posay is one of the number one skincare brands and I get it. It is, from what I've seen from this brand, it is a very good brand. So I'm gonna continue using it and then I'll check again. So I will see you all in the next check. Hi everyone, I am back to give you all my final thoughts on this product. So I am a little bit torn about this product because I absolutely love the feel of this product. I feel like it has delivered some great results to my skin and in my opinion it has delivered some better results to my skin than some of the more affordable niacinamide serums that I've tried. 
So let me kind of explain why I'm saying that because this product and the other niacinamide serums that I've tried that are very much more affordable, I feel like both exist for different reasons. I did see some very fast correction with this product. I also saw my skin get very smooth and this product is such a hydrating product, which kind of surprised me because it does have alcohol in it. But I mean, there are some great ingredients packed in this product. I feel like even though it is advertising itself as a pure niacinamide serum. This is packed with so many great ingredients that I feel like La Roche-Posay puts in a lot of their products to make them stand out from other competitors. That is why I do justify the price point of it just a little bit more. I also saw some great results. I mean, my skin has been looking so glowy right now and I've really been enjoying my experience with this product. It's just a great feeling serum. It's not tacky, it's not sticky, it's just very hydrating and soothing for the skin, which like I said, goes against everything that we've heard about alcohol and skincare. If you are sensitive to that, then obviously I wouldn't recommend using it, but I personally had a great experience with this product and I really enjoyed just the feel of this product and the results that I saw with it. Here is where I would personally draw the line on whether or not I would purchase this product or not. If my skin was going through it, if I had a lot of skin concerns that niacinamide usually takes care of, and I'm wanting some pretty fast results, I feel like I would gravitate towards this product. Other niacinamide serums that I've used have taken a little bit longer to show results, and even when they have, I haven't seen the dramatic level of results that I saw with this product. But I feel like if you don't have any crazy skin concerns and you're just wanting to incorporate niacinamide in your skincare routine, then I don't feel like this product would necessarily be worth it for you. This product specifically, I feel like, is designed to be a very almost intensive but very gentle serum. It was very fast acting. That's the best way I can describe my results with it. It was very fast at showing them. I really just love the feel of this product. The closest to texture if you are wanting a very hydrating niacinamide is the Naturium niacinamide. I feel like the texture of both of those products are very similar but I did see a few more results especially with how fast I saw them with this product and so that's when I would would pay the price point for this if you are looking for a lot of anti-aging or anti-acne or anti-hyperpigmentation results if you're struggling with that really bad I feel like this product would be a great product for you as the best way I can describe my opinion on this product obviously it is a very steep price point and I loved my experience with this product and it was hard for me to classify whether I would repurchase it or not and that's just my own personal reasoning behind purchasing this product if I were to repurchase it. If my skin was really going through it, then I would gravitate towards this product. And I also just really enjoy the feel of this product. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, make sure you subscribe because I post new videos every week. And I will see you all in the next review.